What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to CEO Prince Reaction, man. We about to get into this real reason. Me and Leslie doing videos. The truth, the T. You feel me? Y'all, let's get right into this video, man. Y'all just seen me do a couple of reactions a while ago. You found know saying, um, drop some videos in the comments that you want me to react to. I'm gonna go ahead and do a lot of reaction today. Um, so yeah, let's do it, man. Let's get it. Fast forward, the real reason why we linked up. That was a nice little song. So, hey everybody. What's up, everybody? So, this is a video that I can see from the title what it's going to be about. And people want to know the real reason why we linked up. So, the real reason why we linked up. Uh, we linked up. Then, who texted you first? Not that you, you texted me. Um, I think I texted you. You had texted me like four days before I texted you. Yeah. Like, it was just checking on me. Yeah, I hear up to check on that. Should we check on the you know, so I remember. I mean, I hit Leslie just check on her. Yeah. And she, and and she just hit me up and she was like, can you leave the state now? And I was like, I mean, yeah. What I said? Can you leave the state now? She was like, can you leave the state? So I already knew it, like she she meant by that. And I think I said yeah, but I ended up getting out of here. So fast forward, the real reason why we linked up is to not give back at anybody. I'm pretty sure you guys want to hear that or you guys want that to be the case. And a lot of people said that it was weird. I don't give two Fs about what anybody thinks or who I collab. I'm a grown man. At the end of the day, I die by myself. I was born in this world by myself. I'm gonna leave this earth by myself when I get to heaven. I'm not gonna know none of y'all. I'm not gonna know lately because so so at the end of the day, I'm gonna do what I wanna do. And this is and I honest to God, it's not to get back at nobody. You guys can believe what y'all want to believe. But in all honesty it's not to get at nobody. It's because we wanna have fun and give out good content and make money. Everybody wants to make money. Don't nobody want to work on nine to five. And if it was an opportunity that was presented to you guys, a lot of you guys would have took the opportunity as well. Going back to what I was saying, the reason why we linked out was nothing malicious, was nothing sneaky about it. It was okay. And then I can see if, it, if we collab in the beginning. I can see if we could did collapse when everything was going on. No, we waited. This I don't know how long it's been, but we waited a very long time. That was strategic. It was like a whole year, and then we collabed. So no, it wasn't to get back at anybody. You know, I don't care about that. I'm not studying nobody but myself and my circle and what I got going on. My kids, the people that's in my circle. That's all I really truly care about. That's all I care about. I'm not concerned about what the next man is doing. Who this person, what this person doing, who this person fucking sucking, doing it. I don't care about none of that, bro. I don't I don't really care. I don't have time. It's, it's, it's too much to be thinking about what other people got going on. That's why I've been staying off of really social media like I have because you get to invest in, in other people's lives and then you compare yourself and then you're not happy no more because the next person got something bigger and better. I don't, I'm content at where I'm at. I love what God has blessed me with. You feel me? I, I feel you. Amen, I'm, I'm my brother. I'm thankful that, um, you know, God brought Leslie into my life, you know, and I'm not, I'm not, I'm not worried about nobody else. I don't care what people think is weird. Y'all can think it's weird. Y'all weird for even watching us and not liking us. That's what's really weird. You feel me? That's what you, what's weird is y'all keep checking up on us, you know, and honestly, I have to say, and I'm so thankful for this. Overall, okay, we've been they just not used to it. They just they don't it. weird. It's like, like, I don't care what y'all talking about because at the end of the day, y'all let go say that shit on my face. Oh my God. <laughs> 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 it's not a bad thing for it. What's up? I don't give a fuck, man. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. But no, the truth, that's the truth of the matter. Really. Like, you know, I, don't I, don't think, and I don't think when we got together, we are thinking about any of that. Alright, this is this is this is this is my theory. All right, right, Chris, right. Bam, everything started happening. You know the the whole um, Tina thing. Then you got involved. Leslie and I was started making her bill. Bam, right. That's how y'all found out about each other. Bam. Oh, this is Leslie. Oh, okay, this is um, Clarence NYCS. Oh, okay, let me go on her page. Oh, damn, she bad. All right, cool. You know what I'm saying? Bam. 
You know, I'm I'm pretty sure you probably hit the DM, you probably said something, or you probably, you know, like the picture or something, you know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure. You know what I'm saying? All all that jumping going on, right? So then you already, Chris, come on, Chris. I just watched your your, your Chris fell off his video. I heard your words, bro. Like, you real shifty, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? So you probably like that. I want the fuck. You know what I'm saying? Regular male shit. No, hey, let's keep it real. Males, like, I know a lot of y'all love Chris L, but let's keep it real. As a male, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, you see some shit online, you like, nah, I hit that shit. I bust that shit. You know what I'm saying? Males do that. You feel me? So I'm pretty sure Chris L is like, ah, right, yeah, I'm gonna bust that shit. You feel what I'm saying? This is an assumption. You feel what I'm saying? Bomb. I'm pretty sure he shot a couple shots, blah, blah, blah. But you already know Leslie was biting. This is Leslie tight. Look at all the Leslie X, especially with the beard. I know that all of them love the, the, the beard. You know what I'm saying? They love I'll be trying to grow my them. Like, it really can't. But you know all of them love the beard. You know what I'm saying? So Leslie was already down with the shits. You know what I'm saying? Bomb. You know what I'm saying? They talking, talking. You know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure everything died down. Chris went and doing it. I see he busted music video after music video. You know what I'm saying? Doing anything. And he probably hit up again. Shit like, you know what? I'm going to go out there and go see that nigga. You know what I'm saying? Now look, that's who we at. Yeah, I feel that's what happened. And, and doing what we got to do for ourselves. And creating uh, content. And that's, that's really all. It's it's all about creating content. It's about creating content. And that's really all it is. We're not thinking about anything being weird or... Everybody always... Opinions about that or whatever. We're grown people. And yeah, that's what I mean. <laughs> grown. I'm going to talk to all one and talk to you no matter the circumstances of all. I'm so aggressive. I'm not... I'm not I'm talking about the people who don't like I'm not sorry for putting it. You're talking about to the people that think it's weird. <laughs> I don't think it's weird. You know, I, I just think weird. that shit. I, I don't think it's weird. You know what I'm saying? I just think it's like it's an opportunity. You know what I'm saying? It's a, it's an opportunity to make money. Like this is the perfect like for y'all on y'all end. It's like the perfect storyline. You feel what I'm saying? To keep y'all trying to go in and make the bag. Like, right, let's not lie about that. Like, just the perfect storyline. You know what I'm saying? And then it's a great storyline for Queen and Clarence also. Like, it's like now when they come on YouTube, you're like, oh, wow. Like, like what the fuck? Like, 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 you feel what I'm saying? Like, these are each other exes and they're dating each other. You feel what I'm saying? That's what is. That's That's what... It, it plays in our head because all we know is YouTube. We don't know Chris all, offline. We don't know Leslie offline. We don't know Clarence offline. We don't know Queen offline. You feel what I'm saying? All we know was Clarence NYC and Queen was here first. Bomb. Drama happened a couple years later, three or four years later, I think. Bomb. Leslie talking bad about Clarence and how their relationship went. And you already know your, your, your past with Queen. You feel what I'm saying? So, bomb, now it's like full, like, you know, turn around, bomb, here y'all all together. You feel what I'm saying? X's. You feel what I'm saying? X and X. You feel what I'm saying? It's like, damn, then y'all both do YouTube now. Y'all both have YouTube. I'm pretty sure you and Leslie going to make a, a family YouTube channel soon or later. You feel what I'm saying? Then I seen you have put Chris, baby Chris in the video now. You feel what I'm saying? It's getting serious. Let's be real. It's getting serious. But it's the perfect storyline to get a bag. And I totally understand. And I totally will, do, do, will, will fall through with that plan also. But I think what's going on now is, is getting, it, it was going to be just content in the beginning. But now it's it's like, oh, I like Shorty. Shorty rocking the correct way. Like, she rocking with me. I'm rocking with her. You know what I'm saying? Damn, this might be a little bit more serious than what we thought. And then and now we're here. You feel what I'm saying? That, that, that's just my take. I have take. this mindset where I don't care about what people think about me. You no shouldn't more. care, honestly. Let them think. If people think I'm weird, I am weird. If people think I'm broke, I am broke. If people think I'm ugly, I am ugly. If people think this about, doesn't matter what nobody thinks. I'm not here to put on this world to satisfy everybody because of this what happens when you try to satisfy everybody. You become in a... Uh, depression spot in your life where you're you're miserable yeah because you can't make everybody happy yeah if this person like blue this person like red and you like green you will get whatever it is that's green because at the end of the day you have to make yourself happy true you know? 
You have Facts. to make yourself happy. I was at a point in my life, and I was telling Leslie this, I was at a point in my life where I was trying to make everybody happy. And I was miserable. I was so miserable trying to make everybody happy. Like, I was just so miserable because it was never enough. You could never do enough for somebody. You can't because this person don't want this. You try to make them happy. Boom, now they don't want something new. Now they want this, now they want this. And then you're not going to be happy no more because you're just trying to make this person so happy. And in all reality, they're not even happy within themselves. Why? Because they're probably trying to do the same thing, trying to make people happy instead of making themselves happy. You feel me? So at the end of the day, you got to make yourself happy. You have to. So with that being said, the reason why I say that, I'm going to make myself happy. That is going to make herself happy and make the choices, the adult choices that we decide to make and not worry about what outside people are thinking about. If that makes sense. We don't, it's, life is too short to not do something because people want to think it's weird. That doesn't make sense. Life is too short. Life is too short for me to be contemplating, should I do, should I make this move because this person is not going to like it? Who doesn't even matter in my life? I don't even know these people. You know, for me True. to even make decisions based True. off of what they want. That True. doesn't make sense. True. That doesn't make sense at all. I'm like, oh, True. I'm not going to. No, and I'm just going to be here to say, you feel what I'm saying? Yeah, everything I say is opinionated. It's not facts, you feel what I'm saying? If I favor the royal family or Chris Sells and Leslie, that's just who I favor. Like, you know what I'm saying? I ain't going to lie. Like, I just rock with the, the, the royal family and the thing they do. I like not because of anything else, but Chris Sells. You know, and Leslie had a love, bon bon. and here these people are, they were over here in love, not bothering neither one of them, and bon bon, you feel what I'm saying? So I'm just going to go with Queenie Claire, and I'm not going to watch a content, I'm not going to watch a lot of big content, you know what I'm saying? If y'all want me to react, yeah, I'll go ahead and react, yeah, of course. But other than that, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. So, so for example, let's say if I, I don't make Chris a bad person. Just, you thought it was going to be weird. And then I would have never gotten to know what she was. I would have never really had, you know, been, been I enjoying care what time with her because I, I would have let other people Chris. get to me and be like, no, nah, you know? So, imagine if I would have let... Yeah, so imagine if I would have never let... For content purposes let only. Let get to my head, you feel me? So, at the end of the day, we got it. I'm talking to y'all too. Y'all gotta do the things that's gonna make y'all happy. Yes, sir. Like, yes, I, I am. I love my mom to death, and I remember at a point my mom wanted me to go to the army. You know, it was like she she put it in the air, like you know, I, you know, something about going to the army. But at the end of the day, I love my mom to death, and I and I listen and I take you know heed to what she and I, and I listen to what she say. I take it into consideration, but at the end of the day, I have to do what you know what's gonna make me happy, and I'm glad I chose the choices I did in my life. Because I wouldn't be in this position I'm in today. If I would have listened to everybody, I wouldn't be in the position I am today. And uh, so I'm very strong-minded when it comes to making decisions for myself. I'm very strong. Can't nobody tell me really nothing. I, I like advice. Now it's different when it's when it comes to advice. So I think you should do this. Now if I think it's a good idea, I might accept your advice. But if I don't, and I want to do things my way. This is my world. I mean, this is. And when you got that mindset, this is your world, you do whatever you want to do. You do what you want to do. Do what's going to make you happy. Happiness and that inner peace is so important. People forget about that. People forget about the inner peace. People are just focused on material things, materialistic things, and this and that, and they're not happy. There's people that got the most money in the world is not happy because of these materialistic things, because they think that's going to make them happy, and it's not. And I was in a place in my life, I know I'm talking a lot of y'all, but bear with me. I know I was in a place in my life where I was trying to reach all of these goals and I kept reaching and reaching. And then I got that goal. And then I wanted these new sneakers and I got these sneakers. And then I wanted these amount of views and I got those amount of views. And then I became at, I was so miserable. And I thought all of these things would make me happy. Like I just got a million views on my YouTube video. I just bought this, I just bought that. But then I kept losing the sight of the things that matter the most. And the things that matter the most is love, relationships, family, you know, all of them things. And I, and I lost sight of them things because I was chasing all of these things that, 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 we, that we think nowadays is important, but it's really not. It's, it's things over here that's, that's yeah. the most important. Damn, and Chris. I when we chase yeah. those things, Come on, woke me up, of, the, of the things that really matter. It takes the genuine, the genuineness out of things, you know. But yeah, so, that was so, that was that was nice. Chris. To say we didn't collide to be to spiteful be messy, or messy. To, to get back care. Whatever. That was a case that would have been a long time ago. Absolutely. 
and what it was in the case. It was pure. Oh, the pure, these are pure videos. Pure. <laughs> it was purely innocently. Okay, well, <laughs> you guys, it was pure. You feel what I'm saying? We're gonna leave it at that. It was pure. It was pure. You know what I'm saying? They said it was pure. It was pure. You feel what I'm saying? So, look, man, you better get um out of here. You know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all hit that subscribe button. Make sure you like and make sure you leave a comment on what video you want me to react to.